Hi everybody, welcome back to the Tetrix RoboBite video series. This is Tim from Pitsco Education. Today's RoboBite, I wanna to talk to you about the Tetrix Max angle pieces. Uh, these are part of the structure category in the Tetrix Max ecosystem. They're a very robust building element. They are a three millimeter thick. They come in two different sizes, or lengths rather. They come in 144 millimeter long, and then they also come in 288 millimeters long. They come in packages of two, so you get two of these in each uh, package when you get those. They are used basically to create very robust structural elements. So here's an example of how you might put those together. Again, in this direction, I'm taking advantage of the angle piece, and you can see that with those connected together, I've got a very strong, very stiff type of a structure. Hole pattern, I'm using these standoffs to highlight the hole pattern, how they align with the traditional circular pattern of the Tetrix. Again, it doesn't have the full circular pattern, it just has the center line hole pattern, so you need to remember that when you're lining your pieces. The other thing that you need to think about uh, is the uh, thickness, because they are um, three millimeters thick, the shorter of the socket head cap screws might not be long enough. You might need to make sure that you use the half inch socket head cap screw in order to get enough length to go through and uh, securely contact into the cap nut. The purpose of this is a very robust and very strong structure, so you wanna make sure you have enough thread engagement for the socket head cap screws to really take advantage of that. Other than that, um, there's really not a lot of uncommon uses. Uh, the uh, troubleshooting things that you might, again, think about is the thickness, like I mentioned, and just the fact that you don't have the full circular pattern in your holes. Other than that, remember, for additional resources, you can always go to uh, www.pitsco.com, and at the bottom of every product page, there are specific files that are uh, directly related to that particular product. Things like spec sheets, CAD files, everything you need to know about that particular product is at the bottom of the product page. So like we say, have fun, build some robots, come back and see us.